play here this game is still in oh my god so, she just uh, said it uh, everything you see here might not be exactly good lord the confirmed game, really oh no what the game's gonna look oh like no like you know what that means guys you know what that means you know what that means oh no she confirmed it <laughs> shit oh she just confirmed it oh no she confirmed it can you tell us a little bit about uh, the story in the background of what's going on right now? She right? said the bracelet, and then they said we can't talk about it yet. Oh, no. No. That means it's not, it doesn't mean Mega Evolution, it's the other thing. Oh, no. Fusion, or whatever it's called. Yeah, that's what. She, that's what. That's why she said we can't talk about it yet. Oh no! <laughs> People were right. They were right. Oh man! And I think here we can see what we were talking about earlier. Oh, you're just jumping into the low grass. <laughs> Oh. As a what? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> so as you can see in the Alola region, obviously it's not just new Pokemon that are unique to the Alola region, but from other regions you see Pokemon. Do catch it. Does she have? Oh no, it doesn't have Pokeball. Yeah, where's Pug? <laughs> Where's Shane? Where are they at? Actually standing behind uh, the, po the Pokemon uh, in the battle. So we really wanted to express this uh, feeling of the trainer always being with his or her Pokemon. Yeah, let's talk about that in a little bit more detail here because I feel like there's so much that you've Oh, done man. Uh, the way the yeah, the new layout is, is nice looking. looking. Look at it. Really intense and really immersive. I was wondering if we could talk a little bit more about that with what you did with um, the lighting and the dynamic camera angles here. Mm. Oh, I will freak out if they say that you can use the new 3DS to like change the camera. I would go wild on that. It was an idea that I thought that they should add. So yeah, there's some cool lighting uh, effects that we're doing here where, the, for example, like the shadow, you see it's uh, in the evening right now, so it's a bit longer, but depending on the time of day, the, the lighting will kind of uh, affect the mood. Less chance that. of hitting the run button. Oh, Lord. Still for a second to let us see how the camera is, is moving around. And this is something that'll just happen for you if you're staying still in the battle for a moment. And you really get a good chance to get a look at these Pokemon and the area that you're in and the environment. Oh, God. So yeah, there's uh, definitely some cool, uh, we tried to make the camera feel really dy dynamic uh, in the battles this time around. And actually, as uh, Terry gets started in the battle here, I was wondering if we could talk a little bit more about uh, the different changes you've made to the battle interface. I know there's a lot here that's really interesting, which makes the game really accessible to new players. Maybe this is their first Pokemon game, but it's also, I think, really satisfying as someone who's played a lot of Pokemon games. It just it feels really good, the changes that you've made here. L plus A, you click L plus A to get the info on the move. It's interesting. It's interesting. Oh, I'm sure it'll have good music. It'll be kind of more islandy. Like, have more of a tropical feel to it. I think it's been so helpful. There, there are just so many Pokemon that you have to, to keep in mind now as you're battling. It's so nice to be able to pull it up and if maybe you don't quite remember what something does. Being able to just pop it up really Got faster. Like you don't have to use that information, but if maybe your memory is not as good as it used to be and you need it, it's so nice to be able Wait, to Wait, what the hell? Take a look. <laughs> Why do you use Growl? <laughs> oh, you're a tank now. Poplio for bulky water type. Confirmed. So actually you can see there's the... 
you can tap on the uh, 2D Pokemon icon that's at the, the touch screen and see how its parameters actually just well, What, Poplio uh, physical wall? Is that what we're seeing here? <laughs> so as you just said, like a lot of things that you had to keep in your head, you had to remember uh, before, now visualized on the interface itself. Right, let's see how this battle goes. Are you, are you planning on trying to capture this? I'm going to begin Pokemon my quest or? to catch them all. Oh. Okay, good luck. It's coming in. It's coming It's coming Yeah, get it. You can oh. do it, I think. So, um, just to, to bring up real quickly, for folks who maybe haven't played a Pokemon game before, um, battling Pokemon is really important. Oh. Oh. Got it. Oh, did you see that? Oh, um, did you see that? Game, if you're interested in battle and strategy, and then dude, it like lit up. All these really Pokemon that you meet. And, oh, and Poplio leveled up. Good job. And it was nice there too, seeing how the the level up change. Oh, and this is actually something that we should oh, talk about as well. Oh, uh, what on earth? Whoa, about, um, check that out. When it registers in the Pokédex, that is nice looking right there. We're getting nowhere because of your costume. <laughs> <laughs> wow, <laughs> savage. Oh, man. So one of the things oh, we wanted man. to do with the Pokedex this time was really encourage players to, again, really want to catch them all, really fill up the Pokedex. And one way we've done that, as you can see, there's the Ladybug just got registered, but next to it is a white Pokeball icon. I will never be quiet, an empty space, Edgar. Which means that either it has an evolution, or maybe there's another Pokemon out there. Kind of you can't to contain my hype. So that'll kind of encourage players to really want to fill up that empty space, go out and search and, you know, catch all different types of Pokemon and kind of complete their Pokedex. Yes, yeah, especially exciting, I think, when you find one and there's lots of white Pokeballs and you're just like, oh, okay. So it's an AP. It's got a lot of work to do. It's got a lot of work to do. It's got a lot that Zelda trailer will fuel me throughout the rest of the day to be the hypest that I've ever been. Oh, nice. What? What the fuck is that thing? What is that? Holy shit. What is that? What are those? What is that? <laughs> As you can see, this is the po new Pokemon called Young Goose. Um, it's always Young Goose. You know, it's always, uh, getting hungry, and then so it's looking for food. But whenever it's hungry, it also we it's Young hungry. Goose out here. I feel kind of bad for it though. I feel like you just throw it a bag of chips or something, and it'd be like, "Thank <laughs> you." Always hungry. <laughs> Hashtag throw it a bag of chips. Oh, oh, oh yes. <clears throat> Getting close there. You'll probably be able to catch this one. Run away. Oh. It's a <laughs> small <laughs> sample. <laughs> yeah, this is always like the most Yo, get it. seconds in any Pokemon <clears throat> player's life. <laughs> <Just> <clears throat> the, oh. Oh. Hey! And actually, this will give us a chance to maybe take a look Young at the Goose. Pokedex. So we've got a Let's look at it. To check out. Oh, what? What just happened? What just happened? Did they like change to a different graphic? So you've got some uh, some interesting changes. No! 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 Stop! 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 Ooh! Why is it buffering so much? Helps you. Can't take it. I can't take it. It's buffering like crazy. So it'll tell you information about uh, Pokemon that you really No! Actually, we're, we're still really early in the game. We don't have the Rotom Pokedex, so the touchscreen is just black on the bottom, but you'll get it later. And here, actually, this is a great chance. If we just, like, take a little quick circle around, we can show off uh, mm -hmm. not only the trainer's proportions, but also the, mm -hmm. the movement is a little bit different than what um, so folks who played previous Pokemon games have expected. Oh, my God. Pug, you missed, like, the most amazing Zelda trailer I've ever seen in my life. Oh. So, yeah, you can move around free. We just caught a new Pokemon. Oh, oh and I, we need to tell players what's going on here. Uh, when they're seeing the, the shadow. <coughs> 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 
まあ、今、あそこのキャラクターがこうモンスターボールをこう投げてるんですけどあれはこうポケモントレーナーですねでポケモントレーナーの視線に引っかからないように、まあ、上下でこうそのキャラクターを見てるんですけど、これは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは何ですかこれは So I can either avoid her or actually battle her. Yeah, cool. Battle her, Suruka, or Sakiruka. I think we'll wanna battle her. Yeah, like, it feels like that moment where two people are like, glaring at each other. <laughs> Ready to fight. <laughs> <laughs> But it is really nice if you're in a position where maybe you're trying to get somewhere really quickly or your Pokemon aren't in great shape right now, you don't want to fight. It's, it's nice to have that second where you can avoid it before you just kind of stumble yourself into a battle. Caterpie! Yeah, that's right. I think as we can see here,、um, we're seeing the other trainer as well. And it's really nice actually just to get、uh, such a good look at the Pokemon proportions alongside their trainers. The old Caterpie is small though. So, the size of the Pokemon size is very small. So, the size of the Pokemon size is very small. So, the size of the Pokemon size is very small. Yeah, it's definitely one of the new things. I think by having the trainers in battle, like you mentioned, it really gives you that sense of scale. And I think from the experience I've had at the office playing this game, it's really going to surprise people when they take a look at just how big and small certain Pokemon are when they're actually standing right next to them. Dude, it hits like a. It's like a train, though. ああ。I think there might be some more folks we can battle up here. As we're walking around, a, I'm hoping folks who are watching are listening with the volume up so they can hear the,、oh. the music in this area. I, just, I found it really great how it feels. Oh、uh, shit. It really fits in with the tropical environment. <laughs> I love how enthusiastic he looks. <laughs> Alright, I'll order. <laughs> <laughs> He's got young goose. Now <coughs> <coughs> we can see as Terry's battling here, young、um, goose. The battle interface is set up. It's really easy to just get super involved in the battle to, to whatever extent you want to be.、Um, you've got all this information at your fingertips. It's not that you have to look at it all, but it's so nice that. If there's anything that you need to check on, you can do it so quickly、mm -hmm. and, and you still feel really immersed in the battle. どんな状態だったっけとか、まあ、そういったことがすぐこう情報に出せるということは初心者でも、まあ、この奥深いバトルにまあ、とつきやすくなるかなと入れました。そ<笑>れ、so yeah, of course, really, there's a lot of depth to the battles, but you don't have, for example, beginners, for example, maybe they don't want to, or they won't remember a lot of these uh, uh, different status changes and whatnot, but you can really quickly check on the, the state and see how things have changed. I'll say, I, I love Young Goose's painting animation. <laughs> <laughs> Just so cute. 気絶の演出が可愛いですね。何が出るというのはですね。I was in soft spot for Pokemon. Oh, what the? ウォッドポーカー
I think that the level of detail you guys have put into all the Pokemon animations in this game is really fantastic. Wood poker <laughs> confirmed. <laughs> Hashtag <laughs> wood <laughs> poker. Ah. Oh no no Terry! Oh no! Oh, oh. oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully one of your new friends is ready to help us out. That's a good chance to mention, actually, uh, we did find a Pokeball earlier as we were walking around, and you can find some good items to help you out along the way that can help you heal up your Pokemon. And oh. High risk. <laughs> バックが終わったら、ちょっと帰ってできるんじゃないかな。あ、捕まってよかった。ドキドキしますね、これ。これもちょっとワイプしちゃって。まあ、これでレベルアップ。ベイビーとか。オモスアナザー。はい。ゲ
thing was just for the trailer, or if like if we can customize our names and characters and stuff. It's probably. Hey, it's a Pichu. Worth paying attention to that name. Oh, wood poker. How about a Pichu? Who looks adorable? Leave it to me. Wait, does that thing have an electric move? What is he doing? Just kill it. And here we can see, see what he's done checking for different effects. Oh, no. Wait a second. Poplio. Poplio's so special tank? I'm really hoping that you guys were able to special wall, maybe? Nice hmm? it, it absorbed that Thundershock like it was nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it, it can take three of them. Dang. <laughs> Poplio's special wall, maybe? So yeah, we actually took, uh, as the, the staff, the development staff that came for it, we took uh, trips to Hawaii to really do some research, and we definitely... Yo, why did it use Charm? Kind of oh. in the game and <laughs> it should've used... Awesome it should've used, uh... Really could've kept the pressure on, though. That's some dumb AI right there. Come on, Terry, show us what you got. Oh, that's one now. So we saw with the icons as the battle started. Um, I think Hal has one more Pokemon to go. Oh, now he's gonna wreck. Now he's gonna wreck because Litten's just gonna get destroyed. Ooh, and a new skill, nice. Getting stronger. Mm. Litten is gonna get just absolutely wrecked. There we see one of the other new starters. So at this point in the story, you see uh, how has Litten, uh, which is another one of the first Pokemon you can choose in your adventure. But you've actually encountered uh, Litten's about to be put out. Litten once in the story, and so once you in Pokemon Sun and Moon, once you've battled the Pokemon once, the next time you battle it, you'll get information on your move list about which moves are effective and which ones aren't. He's, they're not. They're not doing anything yet because they know that when they do this, it's gonna get. Super <laughs> strong. I think I'll stick with that one. Yeah. So just coming back to make it all very easy to understand for even beginners of the games. Oh. It really is so nice to have that information. I think especially when you're trying to catch more Pokemon. And you're like, okay, I, I actually maybe don't want to be super effective yeah. right now. I need to kind of whittle Oof. Pokemon down. So being able to remember maybe you want to use your weaker attack sometimes just to kind of get them yeah. just to that point. Uh, oh, you almost leveled up again. Oh, nice. Good job, man. Yeah. Over leveled. How is about losing two? He's just kind of over leveled. <laughs> <laughs> So I don't think we can go too much further in the gameplay because we're going to start giving away story elements that we don't want to show folks yet. Um, but you did bring up